Hey there friends, Foster the Canadian here, and right off the bat, I'd just like to uh, thank you guys. My latest video, you showed me a tremendous amount of support, and I am very grateful. And, uh, yeah, I, I would just, uh, I don't want to really dwell on this too much, but, uh, it was a pretty, it's been a pretty hard week. And, uh, oh, but this is, this is beautiful, really. Look at that, that's a lake. I dare you to find another lake as beautiful as this on Skyblock Survival. And the squid? Willie, will you look at that? I've got buddies now. Well, that's a challenge done. We're going to get a couple more out of the way. But yeah, as I said, it's been a difficult week, not just because of that, but my internet went down, so I haven't been able to make a video, which is why you haven't seen one in a couple days, which isn't normal for me. I usually like to get one out every... Yeah, sometimes every day, usually every couple of days. I I rarely let it wait this long before I make a new video. But everything in the skyblock is moving along. We've got a constant supply of melons and wood. And um, now we're going to go and get ourselves some sugar cane, which I'm not sure why I have yet to do this challenge because... It's not that difficult. It, it's sugar cane. Now what I want to do is I want to place it around the lake, make the lake look a little more lake-like and less like a pool. So let's go do that. And, uh, oh, maybe I should get some pumpkins too. Got a few things that we're going to do today. Alright, so I've probably got to be quick here. I'm going to place the dirt right by the axe for now alrighty then <laughs> alright well doesn't really matter man my frame rate is way lower than it normally is I usually can get it up to 30 on this but ugh, chugging along hopefully it's not too bad if it is, I apologize, and I'm going to definitely make it better next video. As you've seen me do in the past. I'm constantly improving because, well, when you're as amazing as me, you can only go up. That doesn't make sense, but anyway. Alright. So, now we've got a place for our first sugar cane. Bam! Yeah! Yeah! You know what, let's expand this more. I didn't realize how much dirt I had. I'll take that away. I do want to keep torches, though. As uh, they are still difficult to come by. I don't like burning my wood. <sighs> Alright. Get more dirt. I am very afraid of falling right now because I'm going to continue to need dirt. That need is not going to stop and if I lose all my dirt here well there's a couple challenges that I will not be able to do. By the way we're doing pretty good on challenges, eh? Kicking some real behind. Put dirt here. Ta-da! All right, got like a field thing going now. But, oh, right. Did I discuss with you yet what uh, happened this week that really, aside from, you know, what my last video was about, there have been some uh, unfortunate things happening around me. I guess it's just because it's that time of year where things go crappy for fun. Actually, you know what? Just about every Halloween, really uh, crappy things have happened to me. That's a little weird. I mean, <laughs> I guess no pun intended if you watch. Was it my last Skyblock survival episode where I mentioned the... Uh, just go watch it if you haven't already. You'll, you'll see. It's a interesting story. And when I say interesting, I mean absolutely horrible and disgusting for me. Uh, <laughs> but there was a, 
a mouse that was in my closet that I was chasing around my room, destroyed my room, tore everything apart looking for the mouse, and it ended up getting away. I have no idea where it is now. I don't like mice because I don't like germs, and mice have germs, and this, as cute and as small as it was, must have been the size of my thumb. I hate it. I hate its cute little face. I hate it. I hate it. Friggin' moocher mouse coming into my house and... Uh, I was gonna rhyme, but then I decided not to. <laughs> Comes into my house, doesn't pay rent. It just runs along thinking it owns the place. What are with animals? Seriously, just running in, bugs and animals, no sense of ownership. Friggin' need to get a job. That's why I hate bear sleeping for friggin', what is it, three months of the year? Something crazy like that. I slept that long. I'd get in so much trouble. I'd die. More than likely. Still. No! No! <laughs> no! <laughs> oh, my dirt! Oh, no! My dirt! <laughs> Halloween. It hates Foster. Well, uh... I don't think that's... a series ending, unless, uh... Another Uber tree! Why are those popping up everywhere? Okay, um... Okay, good. Bucket, still here. Uh... You know what? I don't think it's series ending. We lost a little bit of dirt, but we can still do everything else. Alright. Uh, let's get some sand up in here. And, uh, I guess I'm going to have to go harvest a bit from the uber tree. Oh, man. Well, you know, my, my, uh, oh, that's another thing. My internet went down immediately after I got Battlefield 3. Like, the day that I got Battlefield 3. So I played the campaign, and I experienced a glitch that had me, no spoilers by the way, but the glitch had, it was on the level in uh, Paris where, I'm not going to discuss what you're doing, in case you haven't played already, but I'm chasing a guy down, and it goes into one of those, like, action sequences where you gotta hit the buttons in real time, and um, I, I thought that I had figured out the pattern, anytime you get enough fight, a fist fight, you just tap R, what am I doing, or tap the right trigger rather, and then, you know, you stab him in the neck, so I was expecting the right trigger button to pop up, but no, I had to hit B, so I ended up dying, and when I restarted, all I could do was swim in the streets of Paris, it was a really weird game-breaking glitch, well, not game breaking, but it, uh, I couldn't complete the level, I had to restart. And that made me a sad Canadian once again. Then my internet's back up now. Uh, I've seen your guys' messages, I've read them all, or as many as I could get to. No, wait, I have read them all. Unless someone's posting a comment right now, I've read them all. Yes, I, uh,. You see, I actually do, this is going to sound pathetic, I sit by my computer most of the day and uh, refresh the page, waiting for someone to notice me. <laughs> it's not quite that pathetic, I promise. I go outside occasionally. I usually burn. Anyway, that's not the point. The point is, this past week has sucked. I can't wait for November. <laughs> Especially because of Skyrim. But things have been picking up. You know, you guys, uh, your guys' comments have really cheered me up, made me feel better. Uh, I really appreciate that. Battlefield 3 has come out and I'm getting really good. I'm gonna make a video soon. I'm actually thinking of doing, uh, a sarcastic review of the game. I had this little idea that I think could be fun and, uh, I don't know, maybe I'll make it. But it, uh, 
It would be unlike any review you're used to, even on YouTube with the wacky characters that we have on the site. Hey, sugarcane. All right. And you know what? Once I plant the other two canes, I'm going to give myself the challenge. So, let's get another challenge done. One. Oh, eh. Ah, I tried to make that symmetrical, but I failed. Anyway, challenge done. I've gotten quite a few way. I, I actually started this series thinking I'm going to die pretty quickly. Things are not going to go over well. Uh... You know, I, I think I'll take down that uber tree off camera, because that's going to take a while. Or should I keep it like that? Like a big green spear, ah, sphere. I have a problem with that word. In the sky. <laughs> I have a problem with a lot of words. Mainly the ones with letters and... Yeah. Just the ones with letters I have problems with. Numbers? I can... Oh man, I don't have a problem with numbers at all, unless I have to add them, subtract them, divide them, multiply them, do anything with them, but I can, oh man, the other stuff that you can do with numbers, I'm great at it. I don't know what that is, but I'm great at it. Alright, get my hoe back. There we go. Get more wood, so I can... Oh, fantastic. Fantastic. Oh, fantastic. Just fantastic. Oh, well, we'll... There we go. Don't need to use that wood pick, so I might as well waste it. Oh, right. I fixed the dungeon, so Enderman can no longer spawn there. Ah, oh, man, I'm... All the melons and everything are lost. Oh, well, it, it's mostly non-essential stuff. Dirt, pretty much used dirt for everything that's needed. Ah, oh, really? Screw you! Screw... Oh, God. Oh, God. Did I say screw you? Because I meant... Aw, oh, screw you. This is great. I've, I only died twice. Up to this point, and I've died twice in this episode already. Ah, oh, that is shameful. Shameful in building terrain. Ah, uh, now it's starting to feel like the 404 challenge. Do I have any? Please tell me I have. No, I don't. I was hoping that I had some charcoal in there so that I could. Fix no, don't get near my melons. No I'm trying to knock you off the edge, it's not working. How is it not working? Oh skeleton. Shoot him skeleton. Oh Blah. I have bad timing, don't I? Oh up 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 you gave me too much time. Ha 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 Alright, there we go. Gave me way too much time. You can't give Foster the Canadian that much time because when you stand still and don't shoot at me, oh man, that's when I'm at my best. Alright. Let's, um, stand over here until daytime so that nothing else spawns and kills me and is mean. Oh, man, my inventory is all messed up now, and... <laughs> I'm not sure. I'm having a problem with my shift key, because I was definitely holding that down. I'm afraid just to go off even a tiny bit now. What I wanted to do was extend this way out and make a giant mushroom forest of Canadian epicness because we have that in Canada it's true that's where they got the idea for uh, Morio from Canada that's what Canada looks like too pipes sticking out of the ground you jump in and you get some coins that's how we work that's why the unemployment rate in Canada isn't as affected 
it was, you know, there's still, ah, people who need to build the pipes in the first place. They're not employed right now. Poor pipe builders. <laughs> I don't know either. Why are you asking me? All right, pumpkin seeds. Let's go seed it up. Oh, I lost two of my bowls. Oh, well. And you know what? When I plant this, I'm... Ooh, more sugar cane. When I plant this, that's how I'll know I'm successful. A pumpkin is a real symbol of that. Do I need to hoe the land? Apparently, I do. Where's my hoe? There's my hoe. This doesn't look like a hoe at all. But anyway, now does the land around it need to be hoed? Hmm. Well, let's do it like that. And if it grows there, then I'll know. If it grows there, then I'll know. That little crack is bugging me. <laughs> Whoa! Frame rate dropping! I'm gonna hang out with you guys. Oh man, where are you guys at? Wow. They left. Apparently we're too cool for them. Must be it. And I'm gonna make so many bookcases with this. I'm gonna make a... You know what? That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna make a freaking bookcase tower. And it is going to be amazing. I wish I had that dirt, though. Because... That would have been easier to... Dang it! Skeleton out! I'm a little on edge right now. In case you couldn't tell. That's what happens when zombies put mice in your closet. <sighs> I don't even remember what I'm doing. Oh, yeah. Oh, you know what? Ah. Uh, <laughs> I think I'm going to stay back for now. Um, do we have any... No, no bone meal. Hmm. Well, then. Uh... Huh. Well, that's terrifying. I think I'm going to end the episode here. So, hope you guys have liked this video. I'm not going to be as distracted in my next video because I will indeed be having a beaver buzz before I start filming again. So, until next time, this is Foster the Canadian. Say and see ya.